Transitional Advisory Committee under the leadership of Mr. Jim Tortolot continues to work through and assist with the governance, structure, the mission, the vision, and the oversight of all the other tasks that are involved in this project. Uh, get, just know, for example, that these are just conceptual designs. Uh, they don't represent the, uh, the actual design yet. Uh, you work in a process when you do this work. Um, and you start with everything from uh, meeting with the faculty, getting a sense of how many classrooms, what kinds of classrooms we're going to need, what are the other demands that, that we have for the building, uh, the gymnasium, the auditorium, which we hope will be a very active um, uh, facility for the, not only for the school, you know, both uh, there's tr tremendously proud heritage at Hoyle Catholic for their performing arts program, and the same that can be said for the Cathedral Pass program. So these two programs will meld together, um, and, and we're really hoping that uh, this auditorium not only fills their needs, but the needs of the diocese as well. Um, the size of the gym, we have tremendous athletic history in both schools. A uh, beautiful chapel will be built in the school, uh, a learning center, i.e. used to be called a library, the, the classrooms, um, all those things are being designed and so far we've come up with uh, the architects have shown us these two potential uh, uh, concepts of what the building might look like. Very rough, so don't think this is what it's going to look like and ask questions like, well, how come this is this and this is over here? That's really not where we're at. We're more at a conceptual design and don't forget we also have to fit a full purpose field which would be a turf field and a track six tennis courts a baseball diamond softball diamond and one or two uh, hopefully at least one maybe more practice fields we have to fit all that and this building what's behind the fence